I love my fucking team, guys. I fucking love my team. But uh, do you guys have to make it so fucking stressful? I mean, Jesus. I can't put into words how bad um, that made me feel right now. Like, it, it's just I was having flashbacks. If you're a Raider fan, str straight up, we got PTSD from shit like this. We do. Because usually we blow a game like this. A game that we're supposed to win, a game that we get behind early, a game that uh, they all of a sudden make every good play in the book that needed to be made. It's textbook trap. That's usually what people call it. It's a trap game. Oh, that's a trap game. Uh, well, I just want to tell you something, dude. Yeah, you're right. This was a trap game. But uh, we kind of got out of the trap and won. That we obviously underestimated their offense because their offense came firing on all cylinders, guys. They were coming after us. Uh, our defense, they were putting in work, guys. They were actually doing their job. It's just it wasn't that our defense was playing bad. Our defense was playing extremely good. Their offense just played really, really good. We They... They surprised the shit out of me. I honestly thought this was either going to be a blowout. And I I had this, like, confidence that we were going to win this game. And I'm not going to lie. That shit diminished like a motherfucker the moment we went into, like, the final seconds of the game. Uh, and they were able to make a couple plays and get down and score a field goal. Their defense is... Legit guys, they were they were getting after car guys. They were hitting them. They were uh, covering our receivers. They were blanketing freaking Waller. Um, Brian Edwards though, man, clutch. That boy is clutch. When you need him, he'll come through for you. That was an incredible over the back shoulder catch, and he just came in and just, oh way to ball out, Brian Edwards, man. Three receptions for eighty nine yards and. That boy can make some plays. Uh, I'm happy to see it, man. I'm happy to see him stepping up. Um, man, we need to get that boy his touchdown. That guy needs to get his damn touchdown, man. I, I'm so frustrated with every game. I'm thinking, okay, this is the one where he's going to get his touchdown. Nope. And he's gotten it taken away. Like, how many times? It's like, what the fuck? <laughs> Referees are known for, like, two things when it comes to the Raiders, guys. Uh, not throwing the flag on holding calls when they're obviously holding and not giving a uh, touchdown to Brian Edwards. <laughs> now, the Raiders honestly put in work today, guys. Uh, dude, that, that came down to the wire, though, man. I honestly was so stressed out. I've never been more stressed out about a freaking uh, give me kick like at the end there. Uh Honestly, I understand what John Gruden was doing. Uh, I know you play for the win, but at the same time, if you can't get the win, you make sure that they can't get a win either. So he actually drew the time down to the last second. So that way, if we'd miss the field goal, they won't be able to drive down the field and score. It'd be a tie game. And uh, at least we don't leave with the L in our column, you know? And that was a smart decision making by John Gruden on that one. Uh, I want to, I want the win, but if I, if we don't get the win, don't let them get the win. You know what I mean? That, that honestly was an incredible game, guys, uh, from our defense, from our offense, grinding it out. I know we're going to be banged up, though. Our whole team is going to be banged up after this one. This one was, oof, I'm happy that we got an extra day of rest because uh, we're going to need it. The Raiders, honestly, are a better team than the way they played today in the beginning. Towards the rest of the game, you kind of seen who we were. That's who we are. That rust is still there. Give that motherfucker a buff because this this thing needs to be it needs to be shooting on all cylinders from start to finish the moment we get later in the season, guys. We cannot have these little mistakes. There's a few things that I learned about this game today, and I'll be honest with you. Uh, you're probably not going to uh, – some of you probably might, won't like it, but I'm going to go ahead and say it anyways. One, our center needs to settle the fuck down. Stop throwing these high freaking snaps in the back. What the hell, dude? Like, seriously. Like, it, stop that shit. Fix it. Fix it, okay? All right. Another thing I noticed. Refs. Um, 
You know, when someone pulls someone's jersey and their arm is outstretched, that's called the hold. Um, I don't know if you know this, but they did it like all fucking day to Max Crosby today. The officials are totally fucking over Max Crosby. I mean, absolutely fucking him over. There's so many holds on him. It is ridiculous. They were He was getting held by two guys at one time. And he still managed to make a freaking uh, stop on the freaking quarterback, man. Brissett was like about to step into a throw. And Crosby was literally being held by two different defenders, mulled through them, and managed to knock the ball out of place. So the throw came out really crappy. And, dude, hold. Hold. Like, dude, there was, there, there was another play where he honestly, it practically looked like Max Crosby was holding this man like a backpack. The dude was leaped, in, leaped on him. It was like he was giving guys piggyback rides through the whole fucking game. The last and final thing I got to say. Vegas. I love y'all, man. Y'all 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 came to represent today. Uh and honestly it was it looked electric. It looked freaking the status was off the hook, guys. I could see it in the vibe there and that was cool. Uh just one little thing, one little thing. Shut the fuck up while the offense is on the field. Jeez. Just, just shut up. Just shut up. Be fucking quiet, okay? <laughs> I get it, all right? It's an adjustment period for the t- city, you know, new fans, all that stuff. Yes, okay, but I'm telling you right now, that shit would not slide in Oakland. That shit wouldn't slide in L.A. That, honestly, guys, I, I don't know a fucking place where that would slide. That That's some bullshit. No, guys, shut the fuck up. Be quiet. Offense is on the field. They're trying to work. When they make a play, then get loud. That's how this works. All right. (laughs) Once again, Derek Carr comes through in the clutch in overtime and gets us the win. He was spreading the wealth, guys. Uh, Today, he actually passed the ball to nine different receivers. Uh, One of them was angled on a nice little design play. Caught the ball, jumped into the end zone while getting tackled. Nice play, guys. Nice, nice play. He was 26 of 43, uh, 383 yards and two touchdowns. He got his. I mean, he, he, put, he put in work. But our ground game finally came alive when he needed to, which honestly, that that's one thing, one very good positive uh, about this game. Uh, most of the game, we struggled, though. I'm not. We did. We wore him out. The moment we wore him out, that's when we started getting big runs. That's when we started running the ball. That's when we started getting good blocks. Henry Ruggs, four receptions, 78 yards. My opinion, he he could have had more. Uh, there was one missed opportunity deep back in the end zone. Uh, he actually was open. Uh, was behind the defender, but Derek Carr overthrew it. Uh, the work out the timing on that. It is what it is. But. There was so many good catches that he made. There was one where he mossed the guy. There was another where on the freaking sideline and toe tapped his way in. Just incredible coordination. Thank you for working on that. I know that that has been a struggle to get both feet down. Uh, and he's actually stepping up on that. So it shows that he's paying attention to that and actually working on it. Freaking love the effort from Henry Ruggs today. Just grinding shit out. And there was, there was a play where he got shugging up. And he came back in, uh, gave gave it a couple of goes. Uh, a lot of our team is getting banged up, and they are just tough. Our team is tough. They can take a hit and keep on freaking taking. They don't care. They will take a beating and give a beating right back. That's one thing I love about this team. This is a uh, team that will get in a freaking fist fight with you. They don't care. They, 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 if that's what you want to do, they'll do it. Another uh, touchdown was the Renfro. Uh Good, good route running. Renfro is just an incredible route runner, guys. He is just amazing. Every single movement he makes is part of a designed route in his head, and he never does it the same way. Never does it the same. He always changes it up. He's an incredible route runner, guys. <laughs> that dude has skill beyond my imagination. I don't know how the hell he comes up with these things. Our defense is resilient as shit, guys. I just got to say... uh a couple of players got banged up and it seemed like they were out. No, nope, they wrapped up, went right back in. Um, talk about resilient, guys. Our defense was just kept coming back. They kept coming back. They they take a punch, come back and lay a punch. And uh, they, were, they were able to hold the Dolphins to a field goal. Um, 
in overtime, which one is the game? This one uh, was very stressful, guys. Uh, I'm not gonna lie, I was uh, I was yelling at the TV on a lot of plays, uh, a lot of decisions, like that stupid decision that we made to actually, you know, go for it on fourth down when we're in our freaking uh, side of the field. I mean. Uh, I honestly don't know what the hell we were thinking there. Our defense could have stopped them. They were fresh. They were ready. Uh, so I don't know why we didn't kick the ball to them. Uh, Daniel Carson missed the extra point and then came back and kicked the freaking game winning field goal. Way to step up, man. Way to not let it get you down that you missed a simple freaking kick. It is what it is, man. Just dust that shit off and come back and win the game for us. Way to go, man. Way to go. Uh, or. Our team is really, really good, guys. <laughs> They're really good, guys. I honestly hope that we play um, with this much effort through a whole game, though. Because th 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 you could see it, guys. It's just a little different when the game begins to when we get into the third or fourth quarter. It's just a little different. The, the, the way we structure our plays, the way we um, make our decision making, the way we adjust, all that stuff, it just seems to change the moment we get into like the end of the third quarter, beginning of the fourth quarter. It just turn we flip a switch and we turn into a completely different team. Uh, so I hope that we're able to just turn that switch on from the get, blow out a team, and then Carr could actually get some rest. Because <laughs> this is the second game this year that he's gone into it got into an overtime game and dude, this this is stressful guys i could just imagine being a player on the field fan the fans are freaking getting cardiac attacks when it comes to this shit this is a uh, the cardiac team man it's heart stoppers yeah as pissed off as raider fans are as well as they should be we should have blown this team out that's how every raider fan thinks of it that's how every uh fan should think of it but at the same time wins a win what's our motto guys just win just win. It doesn't matter how ugly it looks. It doesn't matter how much struggle we went through. It doesn't matter how much the team put on our back. Dude, it doesn't matter how hard it was. As long as you got that dub, you did your job. Just win. That's it. They're, they're on one, man. But, uh, hey, yo, at the end of the day, guys, Derek Carr put it down. Uh, Barber put it down, got 100 yards on, on the day and a touchdown. Uh, way to show up. Uh, Hunter Renfro, uh, ready to get open all the time, man. I, I was loving his plays, uh, dude. And then, yo, uh, they were able to cover Waller most of the game. He still got five catches for fifty-four yards, so it is what it is. I mean, um, he's still he's still grinding, guys. He's still grinding. Uh, when you put too much attention on him, other people are going to make plays, and it shows that we will beat you with other people. If you make us do that, we're going to do it. That's just. How we adjust. That's how we do our thing. That's how the Raiders win, guys. It's like, pick your poison. Do you want to die by death by a thousand cuts or death by a bullet to the head with Waller just tearing you up? So, Raiders end the day with the win. Uh, this game was very close, guys. Uh, hopefully, we get rested up, healed up, and we're ready to go against the Chargers uh, on Monday night. Can't wait. All right, guys, that's going to do it. <sighs> Crazy game, guys. Like, comment, subscribe. Go Raiders.